I'm just turning on the recording now in case it locks me into a, hey, did you know you can confront the boss? Here's the door opening. Ooh, boss thing, like it used to do in Spyro 2. Because it looks like it's going to do that. Oh, no. Okay. But we're going to go check. Is Bianca. You found enough dragon eggs for me to unlock the portal. Once I've opened it, you can confront the sorceress whenever you're ready. But be careful, she'll be expecting you. Okay. So we can do the final boss, or we can do Harvest Speedway. Harvest Speedway. <laughs> Why did they, like, I'm not even going to say it, but, like, it feels like they made Bianca more sexy, and maybe that's just I'm become more perverted. I don't know, man. Like, I don't remember her wearing a skirt like that. That's all I'm saying. World famous. Arches, lobsters, fish. Wow, thanks, controller. Spazzing out again. Hey guys, buy your PS5 now and it won't fuck you over as much. As much. These archways aren't particularly safe, I'm just going under them and they're exploding. Lobsters are horrible. I have the fish on. Oh, so you want to go on land? That's weird. Oh, balls. Fish balls. Well, it's all fucked now. Thanks, fish. It says sardine there. The spark said fish. boss, so I might be doing this and then adding another hour-long boss fight of annoyance, for all I know. No! Fuck you! Bad fish. <laughs> 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 
Burr, 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 burr. Kobe. Oh. <laughs> Sparks levels, yeah. I don't know how I'm unlocking them. I just haven't. It just says Zoe says, "Hey, I've got a task for him. Come back later." So, yeah. Don't know if that's gonna be post game. We shall see. But I know for a fact that we're gonna do the final boss today, and then I'm gonna stop, and then I can deal with some post-game bullshit later. To be honest, this, the other two Spyro games and the other three Crash games, I could just keep going until I hit 100% on all of them. Oh, I just don't want to, though. You know? It's a lot of work. A lot of work. But no real payoff. And I could go play Crash 4 now, so... Well, I said a different name. I thought they misspelled it then or something. I was like, really? Let's go kill the sorceress. And then I can watch Jason movies. Oh, man. Let me guess, your drop power-ups into the field of play whilst I fight her. Wow. Like the magic crafters, she has a magic ability to fight you with a stick. I'm so confused, but I think I get it. I've done one hit of damage. I've done two hits of damage. Uh, I'm 
damaging myself. Like this boss is weird because I'm hitting her and after I've hit her once with a tank that still has eight bullets left in, she just ignores damage from the next several hits and I have to abandon the vehicle. But watch. Wait, wait, wait. No, we'll do it again in a minute. And take a moment to appreciate the hideous 3D portrait art that has been underneath every enemy health bar because they're fucking awful. Looks like something out of like some mutant fifth party Donkey Kong ripoff. Uh, what? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I've never seen this before. Was this a mini game I didn't play? Come and get me. Oh, done. What is this flying saucer? It's driving on its own. I'm just trying to steer it, man. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I don't know where I am. <laughs> it's fun, but again, uh, she's one hit away from death. This is hardly hard. I think the hardest boss was the first boss where you had to try and out ram him. I say that as I need to drive into the lava. I just need to hit her once. They keep giving me these spaceships that are hard to handle. I want, I want the, I kind of want the gun back. So, gulp move from the second game. Oh. So, basic bitch projectile attack. Really, like, this was your plan? This was her plan. I'm gonna kill that dragon. I'm gonna mince up to him and slap him with an egg scepter. If he, if he gets away, I'm then just gonna stand there and go, ha 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 ha. Like, this is, you suck. Look at this. So think about Ripto's boss battle, and think about, like, at least Nasty North had some humor to it where he's just running away. Ha <laughs> ha! She's dead. Wait, how is this funny? 
because they're ripping off their own game. You know, I still have to find the rest of the dragon eggs. Plus, Hunter seems to have disappeared again, so I should go make sure he's not more He's banging Bianca, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sad Ben Lee didn't make it into any of them. I adjusted Avalar's portals to take me to the Dragon Worlds, but somehow I ended up here. Uh, maybe my coordinate tables are out of date. Yeah, for a thousand years. That would explain why the book was so cheap. So now that you're done saving the world again, are you going to visit me in Avalar? Sure. No, Laura. We're just ignoring the fact. Why do I get stuck with the ugly chick and the hunter gets to bang bunnies? How many times have I told you not to taste that moose? It was Billy's idea. Yeah, yeah. Is that true, Billy? Hold that thought, Billy. Spyro, great to see ya. Hi, Sheila. I've been looking for Hunter all day. Have you <laughs> seen him? <laughs> Sorry, Spyro. Hunter made me promise not to tell you where they went. Hey. <laughs> you didn't hear anything from me. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Oh, this is amazing! Oh, oh so Sergeant Boots is peeping. Oh, he's doing the fireworks. It's a sad sight, Sparks. Another noble warrior falls victim to the plague of love. Just look away. Sparks well, is just I guess we'll have to man. find the rest of the eggs by ourselves. Come on, Spyro, take a little break. Watch the show. Oh. <laughs> so, like, he's like, oh, man. Oh, Hunter. What a loser. Getting with a girl. And he immediately cuddles up to Alora to watch fireworks. And they're, like, literally cuddling. And I'm like, oh, yeah, Spyro. You all want to fucking talk? <laughs> That whole thing, why do I get stuck with Alora? Bianca's the hot one. Alora's like the weird friend who's just got the weird under eyelids that make her look tired all the time and she doesn't look like she eats enough. You know? <laughs> like, I don't know. Am I being a dick? Alora's okay. Not that, like, you know, they're both, like, cartoon creatures, so it's not like you're gonna bang either of them. <laughs> Shame this artwork was in no way represented by the video game's final graphics. <laughs> Man, the ending! No money back stinger? Is that it? That's it. Nothing, no stinger. I'm, I'm sad, man. That was the end of the game. And we don't get any money bags getting his shit wrecked. I, like, I'm supposed to get my money back, aren't I? At the end of each one? Like, what, what happened there? And all this artwork is for Spyro the Dragon 1. 
I really don't like what they did with some of the characters' artwork, but you know, and their like personality and design changes, their accessory additions. But like, I'd say the the runaway improvement was definitely Sheila as a side character that actually got a marked improvement. Either they stayed the same or stayed to what they were trying to get across with bad pol polygonal artwork. Or, uh, they, they just kind of added a lot to certain characters that you felt like, yeah, they needed a personality, but, um, did they really need to have that one, you <laughs> know? See what I mean? If you've come with me on my three Spyro journey just after my three Crash Bandicoot journey, you can understand why my eyes are falling out from all the bright colors. I mean, the drawings of Spyro here are incredibly cute. He looks very artwork. I think that's really good because like it, it makes it more like endearing. You know? Because uh, I, I think that the standard Spyro is just really just Spyro. He's not really anything. He's, he's fine. I don't call him cute though. But in these drawings, he's pretty like, he's pretty like, kind of like a tiny little cute dragon that's like, hanging out with his older brothers who are all like, doing their jobs or hobbies, and he's like, I want to join in too, and he's actually quite like, nice looking, like here. You know? In the game, he's just, just Spyro, really. Jesus, I can't believe it. Like, I must have not finished the game originally because I didn't know that Bianca, Bianca and uh, Hunter got together. I didn't actually know that that was a thing. A thing thing? I was just told that in like a line of flavor text in Crash Team Racing by Hunter and was like, oh, okay. So yeah, next is Crash 4, which is not going to happen for a long ass time because I'm playing fighting games and I don't want to do anything right now. I've got like about 30 videos to edit, so that's fun. Uh, so you know, by the time you've seen this ending, it's probably going to be well over a month because uh, I got a lot of backlog to be getting through. So, I got enough time to recover in between these games, you know? You don't have to go straight in again. It gives me some time to fully prepare for whatever Crash 3 is, and whether or not I'm even allowed to play it, you know? <laughs> Maybe I'm not allowed to, like, play it on YouTube, because I haven't seen any gameplay on YouTube right now, so it might be like they Persona 5 it, and it's like if you put it up, we're gonna take it down and have your channel stri stricken or something. I don't know what the fuck's going on here. I don't pay attention to this shit, and it really shows when I was doing the Okami uh, playthrough, which I still haven't finished. And, uh, and uh, when I was doing the uh, Biker Mice commentary episodes, which I also missed one out and I was going to go back and do season two blind and have fun with that too but I haven't had a chance because every single one got copyright copyright struck struck yeah, struck stricken struck on uh, and it doesn't really matter for me because it was the kind of strike where it was like you just can't monetize this video and I don't monetize anyway but like, uh, I'm thinking, how many times do I have to do that before they're just like, dude, we're getting a lot of copyright strikes. You want to calm the fuck down? <laughs> you know, we're going to have to start taking videos down. Maybe I'm not popular enough to be worried about. 
but uh, yeah, I might just, yeah, it's being a pain. You know, I'm pretty sure I don't remember any of the bonus endings for any of the Spyro games. Like, if you get all of the gems, what? What's past those doors? You know what I mean? Like, Nork's... I must have done Nork's Secret Lair, but... Uh, the other ones, Ripto, the end of uh, 2 where you get everything you get onto Dragon Shores. I can't remember for the life of me. And, uh... The other one, uh... This one, I have no fucking clue, because I don't even think I saw that ending before. I've seen the ending before. Uh, so, yeah, this is all new territory from here on out. No matter what I do, basically. Either I do Crash 4, or I finish this. And 100% these games, just to see what the ending is, if I do that, but at the moment I'm just thinking of going to Crash 4, if I'm allowed. No oh boys, it's going to be fighting games and biker mice episodes from now on, I think. I was thinking though, I might do a Metal Gear Solid 5 playthrough, maybe I'm going to probably be focusing on fighting games. I might do some Resident Evil stuff. There's going to be some Doom DLC soon, so I might show that if I, again, it's like, I mean, the main Doom game was fine to LP, so I can't see why they not let you LP the uh, DLC. And I'll just focus on fighting games from now on. I want to do Virgil DLC when that comes out, but I don't know what's going on with that. That's going to be a while, I think. This is out now. Uh, so, before that was announced, I was about to do a Son of Sparta playthrough of DMC5, and then I thought, eh, just wait until Virgil comes out then, I guess. But I don't know. Everyone's going to be doing Virgil shit, aren't they? It's going to be like people telling you how to do the best shit for Bloody Palace and everything, and then just be going, hey, he's cool, look, summon swords. <laughs> so, yeah. Look, Judgment Cut is fun. Let's do it in the most unviable way possible. Oh. So much editing, and some of the sound keeps coming out really badly for some of these, so uh, really have to invest in a microphone. Oh. You know, I've got work tomorrow. I got, I was supposed to be doing it like, there's, there's a, like to date this horribly. Uh, there's a Halloween event tomorrow that I was supposed to be told about by another member of staff, and they're like, they'll tell you soon, and they haven't told me what I'm doing. And I was supposed to be doing these activities or something with not the kids, the adults. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. Nothing has been told to me. So I'm just like, oh, okay. <laughs> but I got beers in the fridge. I'm thinking, should I have a beer? Should I have a beer? I don't know. I don't really feel like it. I don't know why I buy beer anymore, because I really feel like it. I got two bottles of wine. I was giving them as a gift. I'm not going to drink them. <laughs> you know, I've got so much alcohol in the house for someone who barely drinks. I'm thinking... I might do, I might do, but like, nah, probably not. Could have a beer and watch a Jason movie. I don't know. So yeah, like, I mean, that wasn't as boring as I originally thought. Like, I really didn't like Spyro 3. It's not the strongest game, in my opinion, out of the trilogy, but like, you know, it's like... It's by no means bad by that standard, it's just I don't have any nostalgia for it. There are some nice things that I really enjoyed, but like, um... Uh, 
Yes, it's entertaining. It's entertaining, but I don't know if it's like worthy of my time to be going back and hundred percenting any of them, really. So um, I might just leave it there. You know, we'll see. We'll see. I mean, depending on my upload schedule past this, uh, these games being put out, um, yeah, um, it will be really dictated on whether or not I'm allowed to play Crash 4 on my channel without it being taken down. Uh, and we'll see how that goes. Maybe it'll be okay, maybe it won't. If not, let's get, get excited for an RE2 playthrough. <laughs> or get excited for like a Metal Gear Solid 5 playthrough. Or some other game that's pretty dated that I'm just like, I want to play this game because fuck it, it's a good game or it's been a long time or uh, I haven't actually ever finished the game. Gotta finish Akami still. Um, yeah. God, these are long, aren't they? I'm just letting them run in case we see the ending, you know? It's like 15 minutes. You, you think I just... You think I just... I can't... Oh. I fucked it up, didn't I? When I first moved in, I was like, oh, this is a really nice apartment, and it is. Oh, it's so quiet here, because no one else had moved in. And ever since people have moved in, there's just been banging and hollering, and it's just like, oh, for fuck's sake. You know, it's just, oh, it's going to drive me up the fucking wall. And that's it. Really? There he is. Do I have to chase him? You. Where's my cash? Don't worry, Spyro. I won't be needing any more of your money. Now, now, don't look so surprised. I found one of the dragon eggs. I'm going to sell it for a fortune back in Avalar. Um, uh, uh, why are you looking at me like that? I am... Uh, <laughs> I've got to be going now. Two lords... Uh, he's a thief. Well, we knew that, but you know, like, oh yeah, <laughs> this is what my friend meant. Oh, eat the rich, eat the rich, eat the fucking rich, eat the motherfucking rich. so much, but now you're the one being chased. Seriously, how much did you steal from me? <laughs> Sending my controller off like crazy. Now this is the ending I wanted because I've been hashtagging all of these since uh, since Moneybag showed up as hashtag fuck Bezos. and this is the fuck Bezos ending that I wanted. He's <laughs> a fucking rich. Yeah, it's taking its time though. Probably because it's a lot of my money. <laughs> so maybe if you didn't activate certain things like cat hockey before, it's just open now. 
we gonna get to the moon? Oh, he ran away. Wait, is there one here? Oh, it's a pile up. Uh, we're gonna see if we can get to the point where we got like, enough to open that door over there in terms of gems. Obviously, we need like 40, 30 more eggs. Like 30 something. But, you know, we might actually get back up to the cash we need. How this guy isn't being murdered by someone that already in this quite savage. Oh, he just plinked out of existence. the ending we all deserved. Now we don't have enough. We can go look at the place. It's over there. Uh, 15,000 and we have... Oh, that's, that's literally every piece of treasure in the game. So I'm guessing 149 eggs is every egg in the game as well. It's not lenient then, like Spyro 2's one was. Ooh, a Sparks level. Can we do these? What the fuck? When? When? We just never get the Sparks. I've done them before. How do you do? Okay, I'm just gonna pad this time out crazy. I'm sorry everyone, but we gotta find out how to do this. Uh, okay, and this is new. So we're going to go back to the first world quickly and see if the Sparks level has opened. If not, I will research later and maybe we will do a Sparks level. If not now. Because I feel like we missed a lot of stuff, you know? I feel like we missed a lot of nice stuff that's in a lot of these games that was just like, oh, I couldn't be bothered to do that. So I may go back time and again to Crash, to Spyro, and just do a few things and record myself doing, like, collecting a few gems, collecting a few eggs, orbs, you know, that kind of thing. It's not going to be, like, as intense, so it's going to be like, oh, I'm bored, you know what, I'll just kick this up and fire it up. See if we can get any more. Let's go get this sparks. There you are. Spyro, I found an egg, but only sparks will be able to reach it. There's a small hole that leads to a crawdad farm. I can take him there if he's ready. So we have to do them. So you have to do them one by one, but like they weren't. To the open when you finished to beat the boss, and I just never went backwards. I feel like that's what happened. Hello, Sparks. Before you take on those nasty crawdads, I should give you some help. To start, let's practice shooting. Press the attack button to shoot these targets. I can't stray. Oh yeah, this handle's like shit, that's what I... 
I tried that and it wouldn't let me. Sparks close up his nightmare fuel, but fine. Please stop zooming in. Okay. That's pretty fucking counterintuitive, but okay. This is just like a, uh, oh, they move now. What was that it? You'll be able to deal with these guys much faster if you use a power. Oh, I failed the tutorial because they ran at me too quickly. Yeah, okay. games, but, uh, yeah, this handles a little weird, it's a little hard, Scheme, but it's fine. Thanks, Power of Butterfly. It's alright. I think that's this game's biggest thing. There's a lot of, oh yeah, you know, that's alright. It's fine. It's doable. It's a task, though. It feels very much like it's a task, like it's busy work sometimes. But, you know, maybe it's just me being an asshole. I oh, I have the red key. It's like doom all of a sudden.
Oh, now we can shoot him. Ah. Finally took a hit. Ending to here's a weird mini game. I'm sorry, everyone. A little weird, but you know, here's a weird dragonfly mini game with us. A goofy lobster boss. Oh, so this is where you use the scraping, obviously. Looks like he's being disarmed. Here's your crawl daddy. Puns everywhere now. Is that all of the... It's not. Oh fuck you. It better be in this room, yeah. Yeah, you know. They knew. That's the end of that LP. <laughs> weird ending to a weird game. A very weird couple of months of me just playing platformers for nostalgia's sake. Well, that's the end of that chapter. Nice work, Sparks. Nice work. Beaten the Crawdad King and found the lost egg. Not only that, but some of the dragon magic seems to have rubbed off on you. Now you can pick up gems when they're even further away from Spyro. That's dumb. You give me power-ups for this shit now? Now? So... Yeah. Should we finish there? We should finish there. Your game camera is currently Oh, online. it was you! I, I was gonna save my game! Okay. The true ending is changing your game from active to passive mode. I just wanna save. Just in case. I'm pretty sure it's saved. Back to the beginning. 